Hello everyone. We already know a baby inherits traits from his or her parents. So, you may wonder is the gender of the baby that is whether a boy or a girl is dependent on these traits too? Let us see. Believe it or not, but it's true. In many animals, it's the environment which decides the sex of the animal. For example, in many species of turtles, alligators, it's the temperature at which the fertilized egg is kept decides whether the offspring would be a male or a female. Surprising to know, isn't it? Also, in many animals, there is an amazing capability to change their sex as per requirement. For example, in case of snail, starfish, etc. That's also interesting to know, isn't it? But in case of human beings, the sex of the offspring, that is whether male or female, is genetically determined. As we already know, every human cell has 23 pairs of chromosomes or we can say 46 chromosomes, out of which a gender depends on only one pair of chromosome called the sex chromosomes. The rest of 22 pairs of chromosomes are called autosomes and they come in matching pairs. Now, does that mean the sex chromosomes don't come in matching pairs like the autosomes? Well, not always. Women have a perfect matching pair of sex chromosomes and both are called X chromosomes. But in case of men, there is a mismatched pair of chromosomes in which one is a normal sized X chromosome while the other is a short one called Y chromosome. So remember, in males, the pair of sex chromosomes consist of X and Y chromosome, while in case of females, the pair consist of two X chromosomes. Now, human beings have 23 pairs of chromosomes denoted by 2N. Of these, 22 pairs are autosomes and the 23rd pair which is different in male and female is called sex chromosome. So, a gamete has half of it, that is only N chromosomes. Here, that is equal to 23 chromosomes. So, in case of male gamete, the gamete will get either X or Y chromosome from the sex chromosome pair. But, the female gamete can only get a X chromosome as the sex chromosome. So during reproduction, here are the two possibilities. It will be a boy only if the zygote inherits a Y chromosome from the father. That means the sperm was the carrier of Y chromosome and ovum obviously had X chromosome. And the offspring would be a girl if the zygote inherits a X chromosome from the father. Here, sperms was the carrier of X chromosome and ovum obviously as we know had X chromosome. Thus, the sex of the children will be determined by what they inherit from their father. A child who inherits X chromosome from father will be a girl whereas a child who inherits Y chromosome from his father will be a boy. That's all for now. Bye-bye.